Welcome back to Always Broken. Today we're gonna to be looking at uh, the cheapest way to put together an ACDC TIG welding setup. Now, I don't have any experience TIG welding, but I bought this to learn. Uh, I've done MIG, like wire feed MIG welding in the past, uh, but I thought this would be a fun challenge and also it would be nice to have once I can figure it out. So the, the start of getting this all set up is I did some research. Um, there's a couple brands, Yes Welder, you can get the titanium stuff from Harbor Freight. This is the Grizzly, um, it's model G0883. And I'll put all of this in the link below. But this is a 200 amp ACDC TIG welder. It's the biggest purchase you're gonna make. Um, this part is $650, but it's the cheapest one that you can buy. So I'm gonna just do a little unboxing here um, and I'll show you what comes in the, in the box. It comes with a power adapter. This is a dual voltage, 240 volt or 120. Uh, so it has an adapter to go down from the 240 volt plug. Looks like it comes with a pathetic face shield. Um, and judging by the pieces of glass in the bottom, the little lens uh, is no longer. So that's just gonna go in the garbage. Comes with a pretty cheap wire brush and looks like a little hammer for chipping away. Uh, got the ground cable. It can do um, stick welding, so it comes with the holder to do that. I think that's part of the crappy mask. This is the gas line for the argon that you got to use. Look at that, a replacement glass. <laughs> Don't use this. This is ridiculous. Okay, it looks like it comes with a little piece of tungsten. And this is the torch. So it comes with a no-name brand torch that uh, you can use to get set up for TIG welding. Comes with the uh, gas regulator, and this can go on top of a standard argon bottle. This looks like the foot pedal. Yeah, so we got the foot pedal to control. And I think that's it. I've heard that the instructions are ridiculously bad. Um, so we probably won't be using those, but it looks like there's some YouTube videos online. Push that aside. Okay, so the next components, in addition to this, that I got were, um, first I got a mask. Now they, you know, you can spend a few dollars or hundreds of dollars. This uh, is by the brand Yes Welder. It seems like they're just a foreign weld company that, you know, they've got an equivalent to this uh, TIG welder, but it was, um, I have the number written down here. 
This was $37.88 on Amazon. It was one of the cheaper auto dimming masks that I could find and had reasonable reviews. So I went with it. We'll see how it works out. Got some cheap gloves on Amazon. These were 10 bucks. Uh, got some Yes Welder um, Mild Steel Weld Wire. And this um, was $37.59. It's pretty heavy. I think it comes with a bunch of pieces. Yeah, five pounds, so quite a bit going on there. Then I went to Harbor Freight and picked up some aluminum filler rod. This is the ER4043. This was $12.99 at Harbor Freight, so pretty cheap. And while I was there, I grabbed these 90 degree weld holders. These were uh, $12.99, pretty cheap. And then, of course, I got the um, Harbor Freight welding cart. Uh, this seems like a nice way to have all of the stuff contained into one spot. This was um, $37.99 on sale, normally $44.99. And then lastly is you need pure argon for TIG welding. This is a size 80 bottle. I got it off Craigslist for 200 bucks. It's like half full. You can get a new bottle from Central Welding for I think just over 300 bucks. But this way I've got a bottle that I own now and when I bring it into Central Welding, I can just do an exchange. I think they said it's, you know, 60 or 80 bucks, not too much once you've got it full. So I will get all this put together. We'll do maybe a time lapse and you can see the finished product. So I got the cart all together, got everything kind of plugged in, plumbed up, and we are ready to weld. So as far as I know, this is the cheapest way you can do a ACDC TIG welder. Um, this one's got an actual foot pedal that you can use, which is pretty cool. A lot of them are just the uh, touch off or um, touch down type welders. Um, but if you've got a, another option, leave some comments below and let me know if there's a cheaper way to do this. I think all in it was about $900. And you know, that's including the material, including the used tank of argon. So that's, that's all in. Um, I'll put links in the description below for all these products so you can find them. Everything's easy to find. And uh, I guess the next step from here is figuring out how to use it. So <laughs> after I make some progress there, I will post another video. Thanks for watching. And uh, if you like this video, please like it and consider subscribing. It really helps out the channel. Thank you.